up for sale now vehicle max we have a beautiful 2015 nissan leaf s edition with only 16,000 miles charcoal gray on the outside with black interior it is still under the balance of a five-year 60,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty and it's a clean title and also qualifies for carfax's buyback guarantee as well as for an extended warranty we're located at 33071 Northwest 107th Avenue in Doral, Florida. 33172 is our zip code. Doral and Miami are pretty much the same thing. To find our location, you make your way to 107th Avenue and turn east on 30th Terrace, which is the only way you can turn. You can only turn one direction on 30th Terrace right off of 107th Avenue. You go all the way to the end. We're the last warehouse on the right, right before the cul-de-sac. We have been in the car business since 1992 and have sold over 32,000 cars. We are an accredited member of the Better Business Bureau with an A-plus rating. You can check that out for yourself at our website. Right on the home page, there's a clickable link to the Better Business Bureau site, which will take you right to our rating. If you have any questions, feel free to call me. My name is George. I can be reached at 305-218-5462. All right. Car has um, this intelligent type key. I'm locking the car up. And uh, this intelligent key you don't really need to ever take out of your pocket. Pretty much when you reach the vehicle, both front doors have a little oval switch. You press it once for the door and quickly thereafter for all three other doors. And now all four doors are open. Okay. The door panels are all black. Of course we got power windows, power door locks, power mirrors, cruise control, a manual tilt wheel. Heated steering wheel. This is to release the front um, charging port. Um, let's see here. What else? Uh, you got um, seat side airbags and curtain side airbags on all the posts, the front post, the middle post, and also on this rear post over here as well. All right. The car is in spotless condition. The panel with the seating area now, so you can see it. No cuts, no tears, no burn holes, no stains. No orders whatsoever. Matter of fact, there's no burn holes anywhere in the seats, door panels, headliner, or carpeting. And there's no odor of smoke, so it looks like the previous owner may have been a non-smoker. Has the uh, factory floor mats underneath those paper mats. Okay, so when you enter the vehicle, the vehicle is going to sense that the keys nearby and is asking me to step on the brake and hit the push button start. So let's do that. And now the car's on. Okay, um, if you're not familiar, these Nissan Leafs are fully electric. Okay, um, they are fully electric and they have a range of about, depending on how much, what the battery condition, how much is left on the battery. This one has a 12 out of 12. What does that mean? Well, the battery as the vehicle gets older, it starts to uh, lose um, capacity. Uh, so you can, you know, anything that's uh, 10 or above is, is good. Uh, this one's 12 out of 12. This is still this is in brand new condition, but 11 out of 12 is also great. So if you got 11 out of 12, you could probably get maybe about instead of 88 miles, you probably get maybe about 82 on a full tank, okay, or a full charge. As you say, this car has no fuel, no gasoline. It works for strict up on battery. Okay, this car is only 16,452 miles. Uh, to the left of that, you can see the P. That means we're in park and the eco. There's an eco mode that you can uh, take it in and out of, which is right here. All right, and the eco mode is going to give you better uh, battery consumption. Uh, uh, and when you take it out of eco mode, you get like a little bit more power. And, and there's, a, there's a guideline up here, which shows you more or less where you're at. And uh, if you floor the car every time that you leave, your battery is going to last you less. If you drive it like a normal person, the battery should be right up on accurate on that uh, measurement right there. Okay. Um, up in the top here, you get your uh, speed, uh, your speed, the outside temperature, and the current time. Um, for you, those of you that are not familiar with the Leaf, the Leaf is a fully electric car that has that's your range right there. Okay, uh, once you run out, the car, the car, uh, you cannot go anymore. You have to stop and get a charge. Okay, this car is the ideal car for a person who um, who mostly goes around. Uh, to the same in the same uh, areas, you know, go from from home to school, home to a church, home to the to the gym, to the grocery store, to the movies. Uh, it has a pretty good range, but it's not the type of car you say, okay, I'm going to go drive 300 miles. Uh, that that is that is not way how you use this car. But the cool thing is, if you can live 
with using this car for every everyday travels around your area you can even go is it there's nothing wrong with driving 20 30 miles north let's say and coming back you have enough to get back but um this is more ideal for short runs and what you do every day if you measure what you do every day you are going to be surprised that you don't uh, drive usually more than 20 miles away from home in any direction unless you're going uh, something special in which case you will use your other car okay or your husband's car your wife's car whomever but this is a and this is a perfect car for uh for young people who just go mostly go to school and stuff like that uh, and just really for anybody, I've, I've drove one of these for two months, I loved it, it runs great, it's got plenty of power, people are, people are completely, uh, they're not, they're, they think, oh, well that car must be really slow, no way man, when you punch the gas, this thing moves, and it's, 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 it's awesome that you can uh, drive to work, drive to wherever you go and go back, and when you get home, you plug it up, you don't have to plug it up, if you just go in 10 miles in one direction, back and forth, you know, you don't have to plug it up every day, I did it just out of, uh, just just to, out of um, out of habit but really you don't need to do it like that depending on how much you plan to drive the next day uh, okay so uh, let's get back to the car itself and uh, I'm sure that most of you were shopping around for this car exactly know you know what you're looking for okay you got heated seats with two different levels of comfort high and low over here if I could reach it here hang on a minute here Okay, this is just a cover, I think. Yeah, just a cover. Okay, over here you have, um, sorry about that. Over here you have your uh, USB port. Okay. Uh, heated seats on this side as well. Uh, you got your shifter over here. Uh, to put it in park, you simply just press on the P. It's already in park. And to get it out of gear, now you step on the brake, okay? And then you move it to the left and back to go and drive. See right now we're on drive, D for drive. And reverse, you come over here, step on the brake and push and up. That's reverse, okay? And when you put it on reverse, you get this um, color rear camera with uh, parking guidelines. Okay, um, okay, let's put it back in park. I believe this is actually a cigarette lighter adapter. I think it's just jammed. I, I, when I get done with the video, I'll unjam that. Okay, you got a, a coin holder here. Storage here in the center. Your main glove box is over here. And then there is the uh, original uh, uh, window sticker. As a matter of fact, let's have a look at that real quick. Let me reach over and grab it. You get your owner's manual with its casing and all the supplemental booklets that you need for the vehicle's operation okay so um, let's look at this here all right clearly on a scale from 1 to 10 uh, this is the most environmentally friendly, environmentally friendly car you can buy um, has an original MSRP of 30,005 a little messed up there I think it's 565 uh, so you're getting this car here for almost a third of the price with only 16,000 miles essentially you're looking at about I don't know that's uh, about a year and uh, three months worth of driving that's uh, so a tremendous saving again 100% electric no gas no fuel emissions nothing it's uh, and it's a magnificent little car so let's put this away here okay all right um uh, the power windows, the driver window has the A, that just means it's automatic, you don't have to hold the switch for the window to go down, or up for that matter. Okay, now you've seen this whole time here, the AC is running, it's nice and cold, and we haven't even consumed uh, one mile with the battery. So, up in the top here, you got a pocket for your sunglasses, and uh, you got map lights here and here. Um, let's see, you got your cup holders over here. And you got a little pocket in here too where you can put coins and stuff here. That one, they, whatever you put in there does not go through. Alright, uh, so, and you got a leather wrap steering wheel too, and I'll pan around nice and slow. So you can see it's in great shape. Um, there's only one, you see the red light there, that's just because I'm not wearing my seatbelt to do a video, so I don't want you to think there's anything wrong. Everything is running and working perfectly. Alright, and uh, you got, um, Okay, the music on here, we can controls here from the steering wheel. Raise the volume, lower the volume. Okay, 
if you press the source button, if you push it in, we're going to go right now, we're on FM1, FM2, AM, FM1, FM2, that's what you're doing, you're moving from fields there. Uh, over here, once you pair your phone to the Bluetooth, you can answer it over here and hang it up over here. Your cruise control, you turn it on here, and then you set accelerator, decelerator, decelerate or cancel up here. Uh, I already showed you the backup camera. I told you already it's got Bluetooth. You got your hazards over here. Uh, an auxiliary input here for your iPod. And you got a uh, disk drive up in the top here. Okay, so now um, you got also interval uh, wipers. All right, and uh, not, so not to turn off the car, you just come and press here. To turn off the car, you don't have to step on the brake. It's only to turn it on. All right, so now when we exit the vehicle, um, if you're ready to to lock your car, to say you're parking in a mall or something, now you want to lock the car, you just come over here and press once. And now all the doors are locked. I'm going to open them up again by pressing twice. One, two, and there, the first one I open the driver door, second one open all three other doors. Left rear door panel, same way, all black. This vehicle is equipped with a child lock protection. I'll show you how it works. Push that lever over, and what that does is that disables this inside door handle. And in case you got little ones, you don't want them to be able to open the door from the inside. Once you engage it, the only handle that's going to open the door is the outer handle. To re engage for adult passengers or bigger kids, do that, and this handle will start working again. The rear seats are also heated. You can control them here. This one is to control the heat on this seat over here and you got another one here I'm sorry that's um, you got one there and that one controls the whole uh, heating of the rear um, you got uh, anchors in here that's just to tell you know you have an anchor in there for your baby car seat so you can put your baby car seat in either one of these two outer positions um, uh, let's see here this is a five passenger vehicle uh, two in the front and three in the back and they all have over-the-shoulder belt including the middle row passenger which uses this one here you can go into cargo mode by uh, pulling up here and laying this down here okay and to lock it up you just make sure you don't want your seat belt in there and uh, if you see red here that means it's unlocked if you see if it's if it's, if it's not on the red that means it's fastened down and uh, you can see it's independent from that side so you can do one side and not the other or do them both and go into full cargo mode all the tail lights and headlights are in perfect shape. They're not damaged or scuffed in any way. They're nice and clear. Got your rear camera over here, rear wiper. Got the little lines and the rear glass, which is your rear window defogger. Right rear tail light. Give it a look at the roof so you can see that there's no damage there whatsoever. All right. Let's have a look back here in the cargo area. Got a little switch in there you press and it releases this is your um this is your your charger um your charger uh, uh uh bag and it's got a little thing here you can clamp it onto so it doesn't rattle around in your trunk all right uh let's go ahead and close back here got a pretty good sized cargo area and of course zero emissions like i said before because it's fully electric no gasoline in this car ever you drive and say hi and bye to the gas stations. The only reason you're going to pull into a gas station is to buy milk, soda, cigarettes, beer, whatever it is you want. But you're never going to buy gas. All right. Um, it's, it's, it's very, very clean inside and out. I mean, absolutely no uh, stains, cuts, tears, burn holes. Uh, matter of fact, the, the interior still looks new, even in the front. Got the uh, Like I told you before, you have the uh, factory floor mats here. Okay. And then you have the, the ones in the front as well. And then remember I told you you have that little oval switch on both front doors. So for example, if you want to open up the door for your wife or a lady friend or whatever, you don't have to go to that other side. You could open and do it right from this side here. Right front door panel. Just pan over the seating area one more time. Before we conclude the video, I would like to talk to you briefly about financing. If you require financing, let me tell you, we have excellent rates for good credit. We also have special financing for not such good credit. We even got some programs for really rough credit. If you're concerned about the financing, you live a long distance away, or you simply just want us to get you pre-approved before you come over, just go to the website, vehiclemax.net. Right on the homepage, up at the top, you'll see a tab that says apply for credit. Click it, fill it out completely, click submit at the bottom of the page, and then give us a call so we can retrieve your obligation and get you pre-approved. That's going to do it for the video in this unit. I want to thank you for watching our video at vehiclemax.net.